your first career no-hitter. And now that you've had a night to sleep on it, what does the performance mean to you? Uh, uh, it's amazing. You know, I uh, you don't really ever dream about doing something like that. So, uh, you know, I woke up this morning and wanted to make sure it was real. And, uh, you know, people are still talking about it and stuff like that. So, uh, just what an amazing night. Get to celebrate with your teammates and stuff like that. It was, uh, it was so much fun. Take us through the game, Clayton. When did you first start thinking about getting a no-hitter? Well, you know, you always know when you haven't given up a hit, you know. So I think, uh, you know, once the fourth, fifth, sixth inning start rolling around, it's it's kind of in the back of your mind. And then once, you know, the seventh and eighth inning comes around, the fans really start getting into it. And that was pretty cool, too, to get to do it at home. And, you know, the fans, you could feel the energy in the crowd. And, you know, they're hanging on with every pitch. So it was, uh, it was just a really special night. What are your teammates saying or not saying to you during those latter innings? Um, you know, they. You know, I'm not very uh, talk. Uh, I'm not very easy to approach during the uh, the game anyway, whether I'm throwing a no hitter or not. So, uh, kind of stayed away and just kind of let me do my thing. And, you know, after the game, it was it was really fun. It was a mob scene, and uh, it was just it was just great. So you know what's happening. You're coming out for the ninth inning. What's going through your mind? Uh, yeah, I'm nervous. You know, I think. Uh, it's almost like you're just starting the game all over again. You got those same type of nerves and adrenaline, and um, just realize that you, you're on the verge of doing something pretty special. So, uh, yeah, once that ninth inning rolled around, I was starting to get nervous all over again. It, you had an incredible reaction right after. It's going to become an iconic image of, of your hands raised on the mound. Where were you looking? Uh, I don't know. I think I was just uh, just excited. I don't know if I was looking at any one particular place. Obviously, AJ came running out too. So. Uh, you know, I get to celebrate with him. I've known him for a long time and one of my best friends in the game. So that was uh, that was pretty special. Now, this would have been a perfect game, Clayton, if Hanley Ramirez hadn't committed an error in the seventh inning. Did he say anything to you after the game? Uh, you know, I, we talked, and, I mean, it was a really tough play. You know, even if he had made it, it was, I mean, it was a tough play regardless. So, uh, you know, the effort was there, and that's really all you can ask for as a starting pitcher, just, uh, just to make sure you have the effort there and, uh, he came up with it just to throw it a little wide, and uh, you know what? A no hitter is a no hitter in my book. So uh, I'm, I'm just, uh, I'm just thrilled that I got to do that.